Hey guys, my name's Jordan, and in this video, we're going to be opening a new parcel from Aqua Rio. You've probably heard of this company before. They do some soils, they do quite a famous neo diffuser um, and fertilizers and things like this. Um, so you've probably heard of them. I'm really excited because they've got a new product in this box and they've sent me it just to try it out and um, show you guys. So um, I'm looking forward to it. And without further ado, let's get inside the box. We've got the parcel open. In the parcel, we've got the NeoFlow Lily Pipes. This is a new product from Aqua Rio. Not on the market yet, but they will be very soon. Looking forward to having a look at this. Let's see what else we got in here. We've got another NeoFlow pipe. And this is the medium size. I believe they do two sizes and they do a large and a medium. This one is 13 millimeters. And obviously the large one is for the a larger diameter pipe. What have we got in here? We've got the Neo Diffuser Medium. That's very cool. This is a special curved version. So it has obviously a curve at the top of the diffuser there, the pipe. So that goes over the top of your tank. Pretty cool. And then another one, we have the Neo Diffuser Tiny. This uh, has to be the smallest diffuser I've ever seen. Um, we've also got a little curve at the top, once again, to go over the top of the tank. Very cool. So what should we open first? Let's start with the product we're talking about first. So this is the new pipes that Aqua Rio are bringing out. This is the box, Neo Flow pipes. Well, on the back, it says not easily broken and transparent flow set with everything. Components, Neo Flow, Neo Holder, Neo Reliever, Neo Skimmer. I think some of these products, some of these are um, missing at the moment and they will be re re released at a later date. Um, as I said, the medium size is 13 millimeters and the large size is 17 millimeters. In here, we've got this kind of uh, packing foam. Quite nice packaging, I would say. Definitely nicer than some of the lower quality um, pipes on the market, basically. So we've got the, one of the pipes here. It's obviously plastic, but a strong plastic. So let's just see. You've seen the pictures. Oh yeah, it is definitely, definitely bendy. Definitely. That's cool, isn't it? So very unlikely you're going to break this over versus a glass lily pipe. So we'll set that there. What else we got in here? So this would be the um, inflow intake for the pipes. And it, as you can see, if the camera focuses, we've got two slots on each side, slot on each side, which is kind of interesting. That's, that's a new thing to me for me. And then what else we've got? We've got another pipe, which is slightly larger than the other one. Um, what else we got? We have got an outflow. So that would be the outtake, the outflow of your outflow pipe. It's like a jet nozzle. And then we've got some of these little brackets, holders. These are actually quite nice. They're very, very, very small. I thought they were going to be a bit larger, but I kind of like that they're a wee bit smaller. They have a little bolt and a little nut on them to screw them down to your tank. So your tank, it would sit on top of your tank and then the pipe would go through. And what I was talking about earlier, whereas there's some missing components of here, the Neo Reliever and the Neo Skimmer, they have some missing packaging blocks in here. So that's obviously what these are for. There we go, there's another one. So that could be, I don't know. Tell me, what do you think guys? So there you go. The Neo Reliever and the Neo Skimmer will go in these extra sections which um, I'll probably review at a later date. And just for comparison, guys, I've actually got some metal pipes. So these metal pipes also have 
one of these brackets. So they also go on top of your tank like so. And then the, you know, that would sit at the top on top of your tank. So holding the pipe in, that's quite of a similar design, I suppose, to the acrylic, just a, a, a neat comparison, I suppose, um, of another product you can get the metal pipes, but obviously these aren't transparent and the, you know, the glass or the um, plastic ones definitely look better. And now that we've looked at metal pipes, I'm sure we should probably look at some glass pipes. I don't have the intake, but um, as you can see, this is a lily pipe. And uh, yeah, you can see it's, it's, it's delicate. Lace, basically, if you were doing your uh, maintenance of your tank with like trimming scissors or something like that, and you accidentally hit the side of uh, this lily pipe, you could actually crack it. You could actually break it here or crack it here. And on, on the intake of the lily pipes, they break so easily. If you just put a wee bit of pressure on here and squeeze when you're trying to clean them, they'll crack. Um, whereas, you know, now we know you squeeze these, basically they don't break. So it's a really, really neat product to bring to the market. You won't be breaking any more lily pipes if you have these. Now that we've unboxed the flow pipes, I would like to just look at the diffusers we got from them. Later in the video, we're going to be setting these pipes up on one of my tanks. So stay tuned for that. So starting with the Neo Medium Diffuser. Get this box open. So we got some suction cups. What else we got in here? And the diffuser itself. So quite a long diffuser. And then this would go over the top of your tank. And I'll give you a close up of the diffuser itself. So as you can see, the new design versus the old design of the Aquario, um, this one's more compact. Just for a comparison, um, so we've got the new Neo diffusers, and this is the old Aquario Neo diffusers. So as you can see, the new design is very much more compact versus the older style. Just thought that would be a neat comparison for these guys. And once again, these are bendy. I wouldn't go too far with it, but they're definitely bendy. Next up, I want to talk about the Neo Diffuser Tiny. So this is the Neo Diffuser Tiny, one of the smallest diffusers I have, I've definitely seen. I'm not sure if you've seen anything smaller. If you have, let me know. So box out of the way. We all, once again, we've got these little suction cups. And wow, that is, uh, that's, that's pretty small. That's amazing. So we've got the new diffuser tiny. It is literally the size of my fingernail. Wow. Okay. Um, yeah, definitely cool. Very cool product. Let's, let's just get this out of the packaging. That is crazy guys. Look how small that is. That little diffuser is tiny. So yeah. This one bendy as well. Um, so you're probably not going to break it unless you put a lot of force on it. Very cool product. One last thing about the pipes is that they are adjustable. Well, almost you have to cut the pipes with uh, something like a acrylic cutter or something like this, which is a little metal hacksaw. And obviously you would just hack through the pipe itself and then you can if it's a kind of jaggedy, you can um, sand it down with some, you know, fine grit sandpaper and uh, make that kind of more polished. So if it's too big for your tank, you can always use this little thing and uh, totally customize the pipes, which is probably what I will do. But I'm, I'm going to go check if it fits on the tank first. One last thing I would just like to point out about the product and um, these shrimp guards don't quite fit on the outflow of these pipes. So what I thought is I could probably maybe put the shrimp guard on here, but then that didn't quite work either. Um, the solution is probably buying a bigger shrimp guard. Um, and I'm sure you can measure this and figure out what the size of this is and just buy a bigger shrimp guard, or you can make your own like I have, in the, have done in the past. That would also work perfectly. Just before we go put the new pipes on the tank, I would just like to say a big thank you to Aqua Rio for sending me the products. 
uh, yeah, thank you guys. I really appreciate it. And guys, it wouldn't be a um, unboxing video if I didn't show you the mess on the floor afterwards. <laughs> so guys, I'm just going to go ahead and take these glass pipes off this tank and then we'll get the NeoFlow pipes straight onto here. So then we just tighten these little screws down and also tighten the bolt against the glass just to hold it against the glass and hold the lily pipe in. Now we can just go ahead and turn the filter back on. So guys, I hope you really enjoyed the video of me unboxing these Aqua Rio NeoFlow pipes. Let me know in the comments what you think about these, this new product. Um, do you prefer the glass pipes? Do you prefer metal pipes? Or do you want to try out these new pipes from Aqua Rio? And also let me know if you've enjoyed the um, unboxing video. If you want to see more unboxing videos, let me know in the comments below. And like, comment, subscribe like always. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.